I'm making this video to say in China seven on the seven that Kevin Conroy died. So R.I.P. Kevin Conroy. He was one, if not the best Batman. My most recent. After I started playing the Arkham game. Oh, is he in the League of Legends? I don't know. But anyway, once I got to, once I, one day for my birthday or Christmas, I was a big fan of Batman, still am, and I got Batman Arkham City. One of the best superheroes in the Batman games of all time. I thought that it was going to kind of be trash, but turns out that it was great. After that, I got, I wanted Arkham Asylum. To understand the story and to get more Kevin Conroy, which I did. Then, and it was good. Then, a little bit after that, I watched YouTubers reviewing Batman. Or playing the Batman Arkham games and reviewing them, um, stuff about it, and reviewing Batman the anime series and a lot of other stuff with Kevin Conroy. Then I got Arkham Knight, which I've been playing recently, which made me think of this video. And Arkham Knight is pretty good, but then. But I wonder how they're going to do the ending now. Hope they don't replace Kevin Conroy. And just like... And just said the ending was just a scarecrow hallucination. From the gas still being in the people's bodies. But anyway... Yeah. And... Then... For my... I got, I begged my, when I got Lego DC Sports, I begged my mom to buy the Batman the Anime Series Story Pack, which is based off of the movie Batman the Phantasm thing, the Phantom, you know, Batman, which it was called, I forget, it has like a Batman Phantom in it, what's up? And then I started watching the anime series on one of my screen apps I got for free. Which introduced me to the best Batman and best Bane and Joker. Which introduced me to the best of the versions of Batman characters ever. Besides from the Arkham games. And. I once had a dream, uh, I mean, meeting Kevin Conroy, which was good, but I guess that would never happen now. R.I.P. Kevin Conroy.